Hello my friends and welcome back to our continued plan let's play Secret of Evermore with guidance and assistance from the King of Giant Robots, our dear friend Asapa. It's your boy here to bite all the baddies and sniff out all the secrets of Evermore. Indeed my friends and we are streaming on Twitch and then uploading this to YouTube and it's been a lot of fun. I'm having a lot of fun. Let's not waste any time. Let's jump back into it, shall we? Final boss? Final boss. Final boss. Maybe reflect might hurt. Help you. Oh look, those are fans. They suck. No, they Break blow. them. <laughs> Fair enough. So, uh, do we, we have to break the fans. My dog is doing nothing, too. There we go. Manually take control of the dog. Okay, and then there's a switch there. I don't know if the dog can break them or not. I got to finish breaking these before I can do anything. Yeah. Right. I have to have energized to wear off. I think those ingredients are easy and plentiful. Basically, you shoot bombs at me, and they blow me to the bottom of the screen, and I get hit by the bombs. Auspicious number. Alright. The boy. I think the boy has to interact with the, the switches. What's the switch? You don't recognize those are switches? I just saw them as enemies. All right, time for a doppel fight. Giant computer cockroach. Nope, just doppelgangers. Oh, it's creating doppelgangers, right? So you have a secret target. There's going to be a cleaning bot that comes through. Destroy that cleaning bot. Looks like it was sweeping up the things I was killing. Yeah, but I think you need to destroy them. Protect the, the dog. Yeah, it was like I said, the dog does. Oh, wow. Killed the robot by accident. Is that below right. up? Yep, getting somewhere. I think there's three ways of the, the, or the raptors. But we're doing it right. Yeah. 
Nice timing. Alright, there you go. Oh, infinite MPs, guys. <coughs> oh, just just an inconvenient number of them, which is more than one. Like kidding me, that's a problem, so I can't really <coughs> get them. I am in Sala. You have ball beads? These guys are annoying as heck. Because they keep bouncing you backwards. really well I was drinking what did I miss I, I electro bolted them yeah it did a lot of damage too Bots. I missed. There we go. Are you serious? That thing did 203 damage to me? kind of nonsense I think your bone is equipped right now why did that do so much damage like so much damage I mean having a little bit of damage Take two. If I hit these right, I can hit both of them at the same time. I can't believe how much damage that thing did though. Like what the heck? I mean, it basically instantly killed me. Because it hit me twice for 200 damage. Alright, there's one Raptor down. Come on, computer. Good shot. Perfect. It's 
super duper evil spiders. Much better. Yeah, those guys, those spiders do an immense amount of damage. Like an absolute insane amount of damage. My dog's dead. And yeah, I Time for biscuits. I can still move around. I'm just left in disbelief though, how much damage those spiders do. Okay, that'll give me a second to be able to... That's the cool thing about this spell here, is it like freezes all the enemies. Just heal the dog? Yeah, why is I I can't heal the dog all of a sudden though? Oh, because it didn't go through yet. You were acting too fast. I think so. I'm really worried about those spiders. Well, the magic's not doing a whole lot of damage to them. No, but it does do a whole lot of damage to the um the other things. Wait. Dog took 120. I know. I gotta figure out a way to isolate some of these enemies. Dog just died again. Bounce everywhere! It, I, urgh. This is frustrating because it's like I can't do anything because I'm constantly just being ping pong. Ah, and last time I fought this boss fight, the, the spider wasn't out. I got rid of the spiders before this. Many sprites on the screen. Spell did thirteen damage to it. All right, got rid of the death spider. That's progress. Now hopefully I can uh, get my feet back under me here.
Okay, now is when an army of spiders comes at me, right? Yep. And I'm stuck. I'm like completely stuck. Eight smiles upon you? Yeah, because you had the. Uh... I'm completely stuck. I can't do anything. Because you're controlling the dog. No, I mean, I literally couldn't do anything. I was like ping ponged. I couldn't change characters. I couldn't do anything. I was literally stuck. Stupid spiders! I mean, this is so much more difficult than anything in the game. And it's not even close. My god, it just one shot my dog again! <laughs> ah! Can't stay alive for two seconds. It's not even like these guys are really hard, it's just there's so many of them. And they surround you, and they ping pong you, and it's just like, ah! I think I still got Robo Dog left too. Uh, thankfully, Dog doesn't hit hard, but he is really, really fast, and he's got really good accuracy. This isn't like the first cockroach fight, man. I am I am not doing something stupid here. I'm just trying to survive. I know. I see it. This dog is tough as heck. He's so fast. Come on, you have better robot dog, Zappa. Take this thing down. Well, I'm waiting for you to start spell spamming. That's the one thing you haven't done this entire boss fight. Well, because the spiders are strong. Well, no, I was spell spamming against the uh, the droids. Remember the, uh, the 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 blue things? No. I was spell spamming against the blue things. The raptors? No, the um the really annoying uh fast blue things. I don't know what you're talking about. The, the spinny blue things. There's three of them. Mm, wow, you remember the spinny no. blue things? The ones that guard the passageways? Oh, those. Y you were using call beads. Yeah, I was spamming magic. It's just not doing a lot of damage, though. That's the problem. My magic is not effective right now. All I need to do is I need to spam heals. Yes, got it. And my reward is more stupid spiders. And I'm stuck again. Almost died, because I got stuck. Oh, 
Oh my god, there's so much slowdown right now. Come on, keep yourself alive, please. Okay, I think I found a good medium here. Dang it. I missed. I had a really good strategy and I missed. Oh shoot, there's still a spider left. That spider away from me. to heal I heal the wrong person okay it's okay I got rid of the spider we're, we're good just need to heal myself now before I die that reflect his pain off Spider. Ah, there's just another enemy! It's Good the final God. boss. There's so many of these things! Stop and heal. Mash any button you can. There's just so many things on the screen right now. Oh, come on, game. Eat a dick. Oh, no. Oh. There's just so much going on, on the screen. It's like I couldn't see what was going on. Unfortunately, last time I saved was... About halfway through. About halfway through. My god, this slowdown. These dang spiders! Like, this fight would be not a problem if it wasn't for these spiders. These spiders make everything so difficult. And they're not even that strong either. That's the annoying thing. That, that, I mean, they're easy to kill. It's just. With all the slowdown going on and everything, it's kind of tough to keep up with it. I think what I need to do is, I think I found a strat here. And the strat is that they don't seem to come to you if they're not on the right. 240. Jeez. Like, if I stay up here, I can, like, bait them out one by one. And I don't seem to get, like, the entire army of them up. Game. I need to go to his action real quick. Oh, I can't set the bazooka to one? No, because there's nothing to set. It doesn't level up. It's just annoying how he fires without charging. See, the spiders aren't coming up here.
<coughs> Excuse me. Got a lot of cough today. Been trying to mute it, but the problem is this fight is a little bit too intense. No, 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 no. go down that way. I'll let the doggo come up to you. I think I hit it. Dog is fast. I think I got it. All right, we killed something. I don't know what it is, but we killed something. Dang it, Quinn, it killed. Stupid, come on! Did you see them ping pong me like 15 times there? I don't all oh, these death spiders are coming into the scene. Am I doing something wrong? Please speak up if I'm doing something wrong. Like I don't mind you saying something. I don't have my hands on the controls. I there's there's nothing I can do. I know, but I, like if I'm doing something wrong, you'll let me know. Uh, you see, I get, I get trapped and I get stuck and they like hit me four times in a row. I personally do and not I control the dog. Like you're, you, you. I think you would do better off not having the bazooka equipped and using your level three spear that you have. Yeah, maybe. Because then you have an attack that goes through everything in a line. All right, yeah, that's good thinking. That's what I need. I need different game plan. Yeah, you're right. Not controlling dogs seems to be working better. <clears throat> because then, it is if, fun controlling if the, the dog, boy though. dies, it's game over. If the dog dies, it is a lot of fun controlling the dog, though. Right. right. Okay. Got rid of the death spiders. For this set. No, there's another set coming. One thing at a time. <laughs> and did you use all of your call beats? Um, no. So Horus has a spell that will make you invincible for a few seconds. Oh, it does. You didn't. You said you didn't want to use that kind of stuff. Well, at this point, screw it. <laughs> It's like if I could find a way to kill the archer instantly in Final Fantasy Tactics up on that top roof, I would. At this point. So I'm good. You mean the one that doesn't have a bow? No, the one that was shooting me from the very, very top as soon as we start that stage. It's annoying in enemy order, Trade City. The archer that does not have a bow equipped. Yeah, is there a still... second archer on that map? Oh. Yeah, there is two, actually. Oh. It would be nice if my magic actually worked in this area, too. It doesn't do any damage. Alright. 
I'm gonna drop a save state here. Okay. Good, good. Okay, so let's re energize now while we have a second. I was waiting for the robot to go up to that one. Okay, got got a pattern. I need to put it reflect. Okay, got rid of the death spider. Wow, that was a lot of damage. Did you see that? Did three thousand damage. 5,000 damage. What the heck? Did you see that? I see it, but it doesn't make any sense. No, it doesn't because it's still alive. Okay, that's all except I think the last one, right? Mm hmm. We're getting there. We're getting there. And no more death spiders. So we. Jeez. Zappa, really help if you help me out here right now. Those explosions do damage. Yes, they do. I would say use aura from your Horus call bead. Yeah, I'm going to. I was just trying to cure, but the problem is he seems to be hurting me faster than what I can cure. How many of these do I have left? I have nine left. Oh, you're in the wrong menu. Back out one. Horus. What, Aura? Uh, you're invincible for a little while. You need to go ham as hard as you can. On zap attack. There you go. Ah, oh, it's invisibility lasts a while. There, re up. Can't or not. Oh, he died. Oh, thank God. I thought I died there for a second. I was like, no! No, I knew that flash. Oh. That was a brutal fight. You filthy Hellman. We're going to pay for this. Not so fast, metal head. Now, losing power. Energize is worn off. <laughs> Perfect timing on that spell. Altuan has left the building. Looks like his insidious villain days are over. So, Professor, what's going to happen to Evermore now? Hmm, that's a good question, Mega Man. I'm not sure. Carl Tuan's influence had created the evil elements in Evermore. Now that he's unplugged, I would suspect those elements should be going away. You can take a look for yourself. I'll virtually put you in the sea with my Project Domatic Zapped One Simulator. Let's see here. Twist this knob. Pull this weather. Yes, that'll do it. Oh, you're being healed. Look, you're healing. It has a bunch of weird stuff going on right now. Yeah, <laughs> it's you're, you're running around exploring and seeing that all the bad things in Evermore are going away like an angel of light. Yeah, all the enemies are being blown to smithereens. Who's that was a tough fight that that really was a tough fight, though. 
I think that's partly oh. because of the system limitation. Not being able to handle so many enemies on the screen. Now do it on hardware. Oh, it looks like the... Oh, that's you. Well, it looks like the big battle must have gone went down, whatever. I believe everyone was on a collision course with this toxin, Mega Man. Caltron's info is gone, the balance of the world is completely offset. Only way to preserve the problem is to remove our own influence from the world. We have to leave now and take our friends with us. Or evermore will be never more for more, more, more. Oh, this is not good. Things are getting much worse. I don't know if this old space station can handle it. White Whist, you've got to go down there. You've got to find Elizabeth, Horace, and Camilla and bring them back here. Then we'll return the product together. It's the only hope for Evermore and for us. We'll do it. Uh, what do you suppose our chances are? Let's see, integrate this function, differentiate that result. Mm. Take an eigenvector here and hood it, carry the three. <laughs> uh, your chances for success are waffly zip. Wait a second. Or mm to the seventh power. But you've got to give it a try. Oh, well, let's go, Zappa. We gotta find our friends. Hey, hey, Steve. What's up, man? It's just a time for the end. I don't know how long you said howdy boys um ago, but uh, it's been a few minutes. Boss fight is very intense. Uh, although what's happening? These quicks are worse. The village is doomed. Quicks have never been this bad. I feel you may be right. I'm sorry. I took your fire eyes line. Oh, I didn't even realize. Elizabeth, you gotta come with us. Evermore is coming apart and more the calls. Strongheart, you have to believe. I'd like to thank you, the whole village. You've been so kind to me. This is getting it's worse. Important. I'm afraid that's because of me. My eyes, Elizabeth, don't talk like that. The ground is shaking before. It's not your fault. I'm afraid it is, dear friend, and then it'll only get worse if I stay. Elizabeth, are you ready to go? Yes, in just a moment. <laughs> Strongheart, I didn't think this would be so hard. I know, little one, I know, but you should go now. Your future is out there, not here. Always have hope here, by your eyes. Uh, thanks on the grads. Yeah, it was a, um, I raged a little in the boss fight, but we got through it. Took like three or four tries. And once Zappa came up with a good strategy, it worked out well. I believe the quakes are getting worse. I think you're right, friend. People haven't started to panic yet. Things don't approve, there soon be chaos. Chaos, I say. Horace, Horace. Garland just swoops in for a second and says, Someone call me, and then, like, runs off the scene. Sounds like, take your time now. What is it? Everyone's coming apart. We gotta leave. Leave? We should stay and help these people. But what's the problem? We don't belong here anymore. The longer we stay here, the worse it'll get. Horse, the boy's right. You should leave immediately. Don't worry, I can take care of things here. I know you can, my friend. 
You're a good man, Montronius. As are you, Horace Highwater. It's been an honor knowing you. I'm so scared! Camilla, we have to go! Camilla, we have to go! Everyone's shaking apart! No time to explain! The Batmobile! Oh, Camilla, my sweet, don't leave me! You have the boy! You can have the castle! <laughs> One more to go. Nope. Oh, I'm just counting then. Well, I, I was counting the uh, the professor, I think, and he's Probably. already here. Yep. Get to the chopper, huh? Holy right. friends, we've got to go back to Poldong. We're running out of time. Goodbye, Carl Twan. See you on the other side. Oh, where was Flight Whis? It's not much time. I hope he makes it. Oh, thanks. Some hero you are. He's not the hero, Mega Man. Let's go, Zappa. <laughs> Come on. Forget about the cat. We gotta get back to Podunk. At least he stopped to consider the cat. <laughs> he was shooting laser beams at the cat earlier. Whoa, that was intense. Hi, Zappa. It's good to see you back to normal. Although I like robot dog. Everything is normal. Good old Podunk. Nothing strange here. <laughs> One of the whole adventure was just a product of our overly active imaginations. Come on, there's got to be something here that makes you go... Wow! Secret of Evermore. I think we got our answer. See that lightning? Yep. Well, safe and we're home, friends. It was a close call. It certainly was. Now the adventure in this real world. It's not 1965 anymore, you know? I know it's that time to go, but I miss my village. I will miss my kingdom. <sighs> but what will become of Evermore? Hey! The end. Is there an after -earth scene? There are two of them. Cool. So like, no, oh, you don't, don't think... want them. Huh? You don't want them. What do you mean I don't want them? It's two lines and you have to wait seven minutes and then 15 minutes to get them. Wait, what? Yes. How? You have to let the credits sit on the end screen for seven minutes. And then after that one additional 15 minutes. Why? And it's only for two lines that aren't even story. You know it's what the lines just are? extra credits. Um, 
not off the top of my head, but one of them is a special thanks from, like, a programmer to his wife. And then another one is a different programmer blaming all the bugs on somebody else. <laughs> hey, Jeremy Soul, you know what he went on to do? What's that? All the music for Skyrim. Oh, wow. Yeah, he went on, or not just Skyrim, but uh, Marwin, the series. Is that the, name, series, the series name? Uh, Elder Scrolls. Elder Scrolls, yes. Uh, so there's no after scene, though? They just say, really, I wonder no. what happens? Nope. That's the end. Aww, you just get hoping... two additional special credits. I was hoping for some scene to, like, wrap it up. Alas, I mean, this is it while while the credits are playing. Yeah, maybe they figured uh, we'll make a, an Evermore 2 when it just never happened. Just never happened. So, overall thoughts. <clears throat> well, um... I really enjoy this game, although I will say that I, <laughs> I, I probably enjoyed work. it. I, I probably enjoyed it more because of Zappa here than if I played it by myself. I think if I played this game by myself, I probably would have gotten a lot frustrated. Most importantly, thanks Flightless's faithful companion Zappa. Aww. Um, but yeah, with you here, Zappa, I think this game was a lot more fun than what I would have had otherwise. So. I mean, whenever you play a game with someone, it's always going to be like that, I think. But you especially, it's it was a joy and an honor. So thank you, Zappa. The king of the giant robot dogs. <laughs> As one. Uh, I, I, I will say the, um, the, the technical issues of this game is, is something that... Does this happen in the, uh, the original console? Yes. So, um, you know, the there, there's slowdowns. nothing emulator. Well, the only thing that would probably be emulator cause would be the crashing due to the spell too effects. many spell casting. Like if you do too many spells at once, then you could crash it. Yeah, because the final fight, there was a lot of slowdown. And because of the slowdown, it's like I would get hit and then it would slow down, which made it so that I got hit again. And since I was taking like 200 damage per hit, I was dying almost instantly. And that was incredibly frustrating. Um, but, you know, once you said, okay, switch up your strategy, control the guy, use your spear. I think that helped a ton uh, because I was trying to funnel them into a line. And then once I got them into a line, I was able to consistently, you know, kill the enemy. So that, that was really helpful. Um, I, yeah, I just couldn't get in this one at least solo. I understand that, Steve. I, I totally understand that because I think, I don't think I could have gotten into this solo either, but now I can appreciate it thanks to, you know, a Zappa. So again, thank you, my friend. Much appreciate you. Yeah. Uh, but this is the end of our playthrough. And so I want to thank everyone who oh. came out on a Zappa's Twitch side and That's a good robot, Carl Twan. That's that's clean, clean. No more points for one domination, okay? Good. See, there was an after credit scene. The end? Now, this is where you would sit for seven minutes. Yikes. Uh, so before yeah. we leave, I do want to say, um, like I said, thank you to uh, um, all those in uh, ASAP as Twitch, uh, Steve and Viodo and everyone else who came out and joined us. I also want to thank uh, my uh, YouTube um, supporters of the channel via Patreon and Twitch um, YouTube membership. Uh, e L Epitok, Tapas, Chinook UT, Techno Trouble, Diesel Knight, Miss Gaming, and Daddy X Dagal. Thank you all for all your support. If you'd like to support me that way, links will be in the comment section, uh, description section below. Uh, but for now, that is the end of our co op co play experience of uh, The Secret of Evermore. And I don't know when I'll be 
back with a Zappa on my channel, but on his channel and on his Twitch, maybe, uh, we're going to be doing uh, Shadow Hearts together. Uh, Shadow Hearts is a game that I played on my channel. I played the second one. I want to play the third one. I actually bought the Discord. I just haven't had time to play it yet. I heard the third one is the Black Sheep. Um, it's uh, for a Zappa. Basically, the third Shadow Hearts is considered to be like uh, the third birthday. Oh, no. It's it's a game that kind of killed the series. Um, but I... I think personally, uh, the second Shadow Hearts game is the best PS2 RPG, and I've said that before. It's better than Final Fantasy X. Um, it's better than almost anything I played. I absolutely love Covenant. But before we get to that one, we got to play the first one, and the first one is great too. I just think the second one is a little bit better, um, because the first one, like you only had three party members, the second one you have four, and I like four over three. You know what I mean? More is better. Like, more is always better. So, uh, but yeah, we'll be back here soon. Um, and uh, I love you guys all so very much. Thank you for everything. Uh, until next time, so long. And take care. Thank you for watching this video. Feel free to comment on what you saw and what you'd like to see next. I always love to hear your thoughts. But before we go, please remember that you matter and you are brilliant and you are loved and you should always be true to yourself Never let the world tell you any different. Much love to you from your friendly, feathered, flightless bird.